Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Say Where It Plans. My name is Jessica, thank you so much for joining me here today. And today I have my October monthly in my Erin Condren memory keeping planner. So stay tuned. Okay guys, I don't know if I showed you in a haul or not, jumping back and forth between filming videos and editing videos. So I'm not sure what you're gonna see first, but I want to show you this black envelope. Uh, some verse planning dolls came in here and I wanted to show you the dolls really quick. So this is kind of embarrassing, but I kind of already butchered these because I wanted them to fit in my like in here in my photo album or sticker album. See, some of them did fit like these are verse planning like this one from the fall collection but some of them didn't because like if they're side by side they'll fit but you see like that but if they're like this like staggered they won't fit so that's why i like butchered them because i wanted to have them in here but um yeah i should have not done that until i filmed all the videos but yeah, let me just show you some of the dolls. Okay, so this one, I wish I knew the dolls names and then currently it is mid-September. She does have a launch the September 15th. So this video probably is going to go up way later. So check out her September release. But um, my point in saying that is that I was trying to look up the doll names separately because she does not have them listed. So, but anyway, so here's this doll. And then this one, I thought about using her because she looks perfect for Halloween. She's a cute girly girl. This set, by the way, is called Alternative Rock or Alternative Girls rather. And then this one, I really love the cape on her. And this girly, I love her outfit. Like I totally would wear that actually if I didn't live in like super hot climate and then this girl this girl's from the fall collection this one i wish she didn't have this thing over her eyes i think she is otherwise like freaking amazingly gorgeous i think this kind of like reminds me a little bit of like bondage or something like that but oh where's the other girl oh because i'm gonna use the other girl okay this girl i'm thinking about using and then these decorative sheets they come together it was 55 dollars for all of these alternative girls so let's get started with the plan with me okay i already did a pre-plan video so if you're interested in watching my october pre-plan for all of my planners i'll have that linked down below but here i am in the october section so i did just uh i just wanted to show you i did decorate this recently this week this is actually the week that i'm filming and um this week i still have to wait until i go to actually like till i actually go to pennsylvania but we're in the October section now. And these are all the sticker books that I'm thinking about using. I know it's a lot. That's kind of just my style. I do like to grab a lot of sticker books. And then I have my pack of washies in front of me. But I was thinking I'm going to go ahead and take these stickies off. And then I'll tell you what I was thinking. Okay, so I was thinking about this girl because she's purple and then I don't think I would otherwise use her and then this girl I like that she is sitting and I love the sass so I thought maybe she could like sit over here and then this girl over at the sidebar so that's what I was thinking so I already feel like this intro is super super long so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started I wish there was more florals actually I just realized these are the only set of florals but no matter. I definitely want to do a border. I've been having a lot of fun creating borders. And should I just tear this out? Because I otherwise don't need this page. I don't know. I, I might go back and look at quotes. So I'll just leave it in there because it's not really hurting anyone or anything. So I'm going to wipe this out over here as well as this blue line because we don't need it and I wish these weren't blue I wish they were like anything but but these are these florals have they look black but they're actually like a really dark 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 like navy blue color in my opinion they look 
navy blue. So I really like that there's purple in here. And honestly, I haven't done florals in a very, very long time. So that's kind of why I wanted to do this. Let's see. And I've also had this sticker book since like late last year or something like that. And I just really wanted to use it, you know. By the way, so she's, I'm going to use the one on the right and then this one, the one on the left. So let me put this one away. The quality, by the way, of verse planning, the owner's name is Abby, Abigail, but she, I believe she goes by Abby. The quality of these stickers are like really amazing. She and her team do such a phenomenal job. They're kind of like vinyl, like very, if you haven't, gotten vinyl stickers I definitely suggest so because they're kind of like weatherproof and that's great for me that I live and travel full-time on a sailboat and, and typically on a sailboat things are hot and warm and humid and so it's great that these stickers are weatherproof they are a little bit expensive but I think I understand now why they are so so I was thinking of whiting October out maybe because she's going to be sitting up here. I'll, I'll get to that when I get to it. You know what I'm saying? Let's lift this just a little bit. So I don't want it covering the days of the week. I don't know why that matters because this side is going to be covered as well. So since I know that October is going to be covered, I'm just going to go ahead and white that out as well and trim this. And so I don't know if you can hear in the background, but my husband is making water. So that's the water maker going off right now. So just so you know, that's what's going on there. Ooh, I love this drip. Oh my God. I wish I had two of these though two of these because I would have put some I don't know because I feel weird doing drip here and then no drip there it might be too much anyways because I'm always trying to do the most like seriously <laughs> I really love what this says I was just reading it it says people I want to punch in the face hilarious I kind of feel like that not all the time but <laughs> sometimes <laughs> People really do be testing my patience. Just kidding. I'm working on top of my freezer, believe it or not. So the space is extremely limiting as is everything on a monohull sailboat. So, and you would think that I would stop buying stickers, right? Because like, it's it's almost time it's almost time either i get rid of some or i just you know stop buying okay now trim honestly this is looking really stinking cute i'm not even gonna lie this is really cute and of course i gotta get the corners covered with the florals Honestly, when was the last time I did florals? It feels like a long time. Here I did houses and trees. Okay, I don't know if that even counts, but there's some retro florals here. July Pride. So I really haven't been doing florals. So this is Daisy, which I almost don't even count it, but this is when I really did florals. You see, I did a border. This is so amazing. I love this so much i kind of want to do that here only those florals are way smaller than these ones so i don't know if i can really recreate that or not but i really really love that i've kind of been a little obsessed with borders okay and now trimming this so i trim by the way because i trim as i go instead of putting all the flowers down i just, I like trimming and as I go because I can use the little bit of scraps. I can figure out how to use the scraps elsewhere. So in case you're wondering why this is my method, that's why. But also, it does take way longer. 
I do not like that. Okay, I've butchered this, so I'm gonna need another piece of floral. Okay, I think that's better because it just looks more complete. But yeah, I've only bought from Abby. I would say this is my third time purchasing, but the only time I've actually physically had it because I have a sticker book. This is my second time ordering from Verse Planning. The first time was the sticker book that sold out. I have that though shipped to my sister-in-law's in, -laws in um, Pennsylvania. I want to see about like these dead hands. Like, oh wait, I want to see how she looks though. Okay, hold on, hold on. Before I go layering, layering that. So, all right, let's put some of this down here for her to sit on. This washi tape is from According to Allie. I love her stuff. I always have. The shipping does take a while and it's probably because she has lots of options on her website, which I'm not complaining. I love options. I just think um, that's probably the reason why and also it's just like her by herself running her business, you know. Okay, let's see. I really love this girl. She's so freaking cute. Okay, she's down. That was kind of difficult for some reason. But yeah, you guys, Abby did say, I just remembered that she's been giving like hints and tiny little sneaks about another mega deluxe sticker book with like over a hundred dolls that she's gonna be doing like a pre-order for so that everyone that wants one can get one but it's just gonna be a, a while longer i think she's gonna do the pre-order like right around the time that you're watching sometime in october is what she hinted at this is coming out so to you you guys so I was also thinking of using this set, really my least favorite set, um, this one, which is probably why she, um, she as in Jessica, the owner of Live Live Posh, everyone probably knows that by now, but uh, she probably didn't reprint that in the second sheet. I'm trimming the, the offset, by the way, because they're enormous, and I'm a little bit of a stickler for that kind of stuff, but like I was saying, uh, it doesn't seem to have been a popular set because when she reprinted the Hello Fall sticker book last year, she did not reprint this set at all, so... But I think in this case, it would look really cute. And I remember watching Michelle over on Plan On It, by the way, um, create a spread with this sticker sheet, specifically with this set. And I was really impressed with what she did. See, like, I feel like I should have done some in between. And then this right here, just because I think it looks fun. Okay, let's continue with the border. And then if I wanna add more stuff from Live Live Posh, I'm gonna do that. So I don't know if it's fun for you to see people doing borders because it's kind of repetitious. Is that a word? I personally enjoy, but that doesn't mean that others enjoy. <laughs> you know, watching people create borders because it does take a little bit of time or I might just like come back. I don't know. I would like some feedback though, guys, in the comment section, if you don't mind. Okay, see, this is why I like to use scraps because now I can just do this, you know, use up my scraps and continuously use my scraps. And I don't know if I already mentioned, but I will say I, I live in Panama currently because um, we're here. We're going to do the South Pacific Ocean Crossing. So we're here kind of like staging and prepping for that sometime in the beginning of next year. And so I wanted to say that I had this sent to me here all the way in Panama. And the shipping, guys, was insane. Like Abby and her team, if she has one, sent this out in like literally one day. I saw in her stories that she said that she only got like, like they didn't sleep like at all. 
So um, I really, really appreciate that because I literally got my order like within three days and I have my stuff shipped to a freight forwarder in Miami and then it comes in via cargo all the way to me here in Panama. So it was just like astonishing the rate at which her stuff shipped so i'm really really thankful for that and i'm so really excited like beyond excited to use this guys like you have no idea i really always like i dreamed of having this set for a while and i just caved and bought it but yeah, I had just been craving like dolls and I've wanted dolls since like last year or two. But dolls, like I said, are very expensive and I don't know, I just saw some on sale. These weren't though, but I've seen from other places on sale. So I ordered some more dolls for that for that sale, that uh, go wild, that go wild sale, by the way, I ordered from Capital Chic Designs some dolls. Her dolls were literally 40% off and I could not help but snatch some. So I did. This is coming out really cute. Like <laughs> I keep saying that, but it's the truth. What can I say? Let's do this one. I'm almost done with this border. I'm going to come back. I think I'm going to come back because I'm almost done with the border and I feel like, I don't know if this is entertaining or boring. So I'm just going to come back, you guys. Okay, I'm back. The border is done. I still have this pumpkin here. I was slipping through boxes and I want like a burnt orange. And I know that Whimsy Lux has like really unique colored boxes. So I like this orange is the closest burnt orange that I can possibly get. So I'm just going to pull from here. I know it's a lot of sticker books, you guys. And um, I don't know. I, that's just the way I like it. And sorry if you don't. But that looks really cute, but also kind of crooked. Okay, so orange box is there. And then I really like the purple from here from spring 2.0 because it's like a really vibrant I, I don't know I just really like this color so I'm thinking about doing that on the third and then the fourth I could do I was thinking of like gray like a dark gray so three different sticker books so this is the third no let's do four third like this and then and then the fourth could be a bit layered fourth and then the 24th is another one let's do I could do this orange right there and then the 27th which is right here so I'm thinking I can add this bit here as well and then I could cut the stem off put this end like that does that look funny okay whatever I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm just gonna do this then because I now I feel like this is looking bare. Okay, so what about some spooky looking trees then from here? Because I know there's some. See? Right here. 
and I could do a crow right there and a spooky tree like that and then another spooky tree oh wait I saw this rose I know it doesn't really go but I could do something like that and I wanted another spooky tree oh look I just keep getting distracted I see another skull <gasps> these lips they look so cute okay we're doing lips we're gonna do a skull we're gonna do skull right there and ooh, I could do this happy Halloween though Oh, hold on, but we don't want all that. Okay, I'm still looking for a tree. <laughs> oh, I really love that right here. Yes, oh my gosh, that looks so cute. I wish there was another purple quote or something, you know, but it's okay. Here's a spooky tree that I've been asking for. Should I remove the skull and put, oh my God, keeps ripping. Should I remove the skull and then put this down? The answer is yes. Oh my gosh, I am in love. I'm just gonna trim this. Give me a second. I don't know what I did with my scissors. Okay, and then I need this pattern over here because now it's it's just very dark it's very dark so let's see about this pattern this pumpkin over here somehow I think we'll probably have to go like right there so I'm gonna do take care of the offset okay took care of this offset now I'm thinking if I I should probably remove these cute shoes and put this instead either yeah I really love these shoes but I have dark and dark so let's see if this comes up Okay, it came up, it came up, nice. Just going to do that, and I think we're done. And I really wanted to use the people I want to punch in the face so bad, but then I didn't, and I really wanted to use this. That's really cute. Okay, how about this? I just will come back with the finishing touches. Once again, I'm just afraid this video is just already really long, so. Hi, so actually it is several weeks later and I'm about to post this plan with me finally, more than halfway through the month and I'm just now getting around to editing this, but I lament to say that my camera had overheated while filming this a few weeks ago and therefore it caused the files to corrupt. So I have to refilm this, but I hope that you enjoyed this video, you guys. Thank you so much for making it here to the very end. I do just want to note here that October 4th was my one year anniversary here on YouTube. Thank you for supporting my content, for subscribing to me, for being here till the very end. It really means so much to me. I do not make a single penny out of this. I do it all for fun and I'm so glad to be here. But I just wanted to come on to close this plan with me out. This is the final product. I did end up going around and doing a border and I did fill it out a little bit and I covered this because I want to, you know, not share that but everything else is fine to share. But anyways, thanks again for making it till the end. And um, if you aren't already, pretty please subscribe to my channel. It is free for you and me. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I hope to catch you all in the next one. Bon voyage.